It's been a while, but I'm back. Hello again, people of the internet, and thank you so much for joining me. My name is Angie, and this is my travel vlog. Three months ago, I went to the beautiful country of Peru, and I had an amazing time with my best friend. <laughs> when I first got back, I started this five-part series of our eight days there, and this video is number two of that series. And it is a great video indeed, because I'll be talking about going swimming with sea lions off the coast of Lima in the Pacific Ocean. It was an amazing experience that I almost didn't do because somebody neglected to even tell me that this activity even existed. But she did save the day and told me two nights before we were about to leave to go to Cusco. So we couldn't really book anything in advance because you can't really book those kind of things a few hours ahead of time. So we decided to try our luck and take an Uber to the dock to see if we could hop on one of those boats. We're going on an adventure. The Uber ride wasn't very long or expensive and the best thing about it was meeting this guy. His name is Jonathan and he was amazing. Communicating was a little difficult at first, but we finally got the hang of it thanks to good old trusted Dusty Google Translate. Lima a few days and really love it. But when we come back, we'll only be here for one night and then go home. Side note, I don't know what I would do if I were trying to travel like this in a different day and age. All I know is that I am so happy that technology is so fucking amazing right now. Anyway, Jonathan was so awesome to have around. He was more than just our Uber driver. He told us that the area of Callao was a bit dangerous, but said that he would get out of the car and wait with us by the dock to make sure that we got onto the boat safely. He also said that he'd make sure that he was at the dock when we got back to give us a ride back to Miraflores to our Airbnb. I don't know what we would have done without him. I'll leave his travel company information in the description below in case you ever find yourself in Lima and need some help getting around or finding things to do. Muchas gracias, Jonathan. Anyways, after a bit of waiting, it was time to set sail. Here is a photo of us with Pilar. Her and her company did such a good job of explaining things to us even though there was a little bit of a language barrier. It was really cool to learn about the history of the islands that we had to go around to get to where we were going. And all in all, they were just a really great company to have take us on this adventure. I'll leave their information in the description below in case you find yourself in Lima and decide that you do want to go swimming with sea lions. Anyways. Oh. Uh, okay. And she was right. As soon as we got around that island, I swear it felt like that boat was going to flip over. I have never been so sick on a boat in my entire life. What a great time to be trying to put on f***ing wetsuits, right? Nelly and I ended up not even bothering trying to put them on because not only were they made for like children, but <laughs> there was no way I was going to be able to focus on putting it on and not getting sick. So we decided to go in without them and it was f***ing freezing, but it was worth it. Thank you. 
Even though the seals were really stinky and the water was fucking freezing, I am so happy that Nelly found this activity. It was one of the craziest, funnest, scariest, most thrilling things I have ever done in my entire life. And if you are in Peru, you should do it too, especially because it was only about 35 to 40 bucks. How can you beat that? Oh, right, you can't. So if you find yourself there and you're looking for something thrilling to do, this is the activity for you. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And if you really, really liked it, make sure you share that shit. And if you just watched it, that's fine too. Thanks for doing that. Anyways, be sure to look out for my next video. It will be about the time that I spent getting to and being in Machu Picchu. <laughs> Thanks again, you guys. I'll see you next time. Bye. If you enjoyed this video and have the desire to see more, be sure to hit subscribe. And don't forget to follow me on my other social medias. I hope to see y'all next Wednesday. Toodaloo, mother